Hey guys, it's Crisis, and today I got a Medal of Honor beta gameplay that I had uploaded earlier, but I was asked to do a commentary over it instead of just throwing music on it, so uh, let's get into it now. I uh, spawn in as the defenders on this Helmand Valley Mission Mode map, which is the Taliban I'm assuming, and uh, we're trying to defend this bunker to my left here, so I'm going to set up, set up on the right hand side as I see I have most of my teammates clustered to the left. And uh, I'm using AK-47 with the red dot sight, which, in my opinion, is the best gun in the game. There doesn't seem to be a difference in the stats at the menu, but, I don't know, this one just seems to have more damage or something. And I'm also using hollow point ammunition, which decreases the range, but I don't see that to be a big factor in this game, or as in any game, pretty much. Range doesn't seem to be that big of a deal. But in this game, it does take quite a few bullets to put your enemies down, unless you hit them in the head. Headshots are a big thing in this game. Right there you saw a grenade go off like 3 feet to my right, but didn't do much damage, which is a welcome thing, of course. And I earned my first point streak, which is either a mortar strike or a UAV intel. And I call them the UAV intel, which is just like Call of Duty games, except it circles over your head. Just your player's head, but your, your teammates can still see the guys. And I also get a defender bonus pin for defending the objective, which is a nice thing for uh, objective players. And I see them all clustered over at that uh, ammo crate over there, so I would get this rocket strike, which is just like the all other things they call in this game, which is like uh, a little binoculars thing. And I uh, followed in over there, and I believe I get a quad, quad kill right there, which adds up a ton of bonus pins and stuff, which gets me to my next uh, point streak, which is a missile strike. And it's kind of like the Predator missile in Call of Duty, except there's no boost that I know. And I put it over there, and you can uh, direct it. But I think you have to use both of the thumbsticks. I play on 360, and that seems to be the only thing that turns it. And I get a double kill, I believe. But you can also call in defensive kill streaks, which is right on the D-pad. Like right now, I could either call in Full Metal Jacket ammo, which uh, increases piercing power, but I really don't think there's there's any bullet penetration in this game, so I just end up calling in my artillery strike over at that, that spot where they're all clustering up, and I get another multi-kill right there, and uh, earn either a UAV jammer or a strafer run by attack planes, and I call them the attack planes, and well, they end up wiping me out and causing me a suicide, but luckily I do earn the cruise missile, which is the most powerful uh, point streak in the game. And uh, pretty much, you drop it within 100 yards of anyone, they're dead. But you could also call in Kevlar Armor, which gives your team extra hit points, which can also be really useful, but personally I just want to try out the missile, and uh, it tends to uh, kill me every time I use it, because the blast range is so enormous. So I'm just I'm trying to find a big group of enemies to drop it down on, and uh, right there you see all these orange dots, and... I was up on that ridge right there, it kills all of those enemies, and me. That thing's blast range is enormous. It is unbelievable. I have to spawn back in here because I committed suicide again. <laughs> Would have ended up with a lot better score if I wouldn't have committed suicide twice, but nonetheless it's still a pretty good game. And uh, moving back up to the right hand side here, the enemy just called in a rocket strike on our team, so I'm a I'm pretty much assuming that he's going to get another uh, point streak pretty soon. Second, I get absolutely destroyed by a, uh, a strafing run from an attack or attack plane, and just get absolutely annihilated. Uh, maybe it's a little bit later, but right here, this is a good spot to defend. You can see down; they have a hard time seeing you because. Apparently you shoot out the top of your head in this game. So right there, take a fire, just back off a little bit into the concrete bunker. <laughs> Which is pretty much, I don't think you could shoot through it, but who knows. This game's a little sketchy up in my opinion. Go back to my uh, nice little camping spot up here I guess, and take out another enemy. Burn a rocket strike and put it back down on the spot where every enemy seems to want to go. And they kind of regret it because I think I get a kill every time I put a little strike down in that area. And right there, that dude on the other team just got a strafing run that I mentioned earlier. 
and uh, he's gonna get a artillery strike in a second. That's gonna wipe me out right here. But the game's almost over, so they only got a couple uh, guys left to run at us, and I get killed by it. But nonetheless, we end up winning the game. So uh, pretty good game, and I believe I go 32 and three. And uh, well, that's that's the game. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.